everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a flip through of the Jade Summer Easter colouring book. I know that it is practically Easter, so if you wanted it, you're not going to get it in time to colour for Easter, unfortunately. But I only received this yesterday and I thought I'd do a quick flip through. So it is a colouring book for beginners. It's part of the Jade Summer Beginning Beginner series. And while I'm not normally into the simple cutesy stuff, I wanted something Eastery to colour and the rabbit is so cute on the front, so I thought I'd give it a go. So there's the front. And there's, it obviously shows you some of the images on the back. There we go. There will be a colour and chat coming soon. It's just very hard to do with the baby around because she starts crying every five minutes. And that's why I've got no nail polish on as well. Because every time I put nail polish on, she wants something and I end up getting smudged. Um, so they've started doing what the Hamelin books are. And that's to put all the images at the beginning as well. Um, so you can see what all the pictures are before you flip through so there of course is the bunny from the cover which I think is so cute girl with bunny ears and some eggs in a basket a basket of eggs and flowers a bunny that's also an Easter egg how cute is that that is so cute Happy Easter! <laughs> I like this one. Just some Easter eggs, which is quite nice. And uh, a mum and child painting Easter eggs. Rabbits, there's gonna be lots of rabbits and lots of eggs. And I just thought that I'd get this and then I could colour some pages and then when Jennifer's older she can colour some if she wants to. And, like This big egg is gonna be so simple and so nice to colour that, you know, I might just do this one tonight. There's a kitten in a basket with an Easter egg. What more can you say about how cute that is? We got lollipops in egg shaped lollipops, sweets, jelly beans, and it says Easter. More flowers and an egg and a bow. So these are really cute little pictures. I actually quite like these. So although Jennifer's only eight weeks old. It's going a long time before she's colouring. That's cute as well. There's no reason why I can't start picking up colouring books as when I see them for her, which I will. That's quite nice. An egg with wings and a crown. The little fox with a basket. Another happy Easter. Flowers. In the basket and then somebody else with a neat painting Easter eggs. A little chicky and an Easter egg. And because these are single sided and the back is black, you can use markers in these. Um, obviously, if you're going to be using something like Sharpies, um, put something between the next page, otherwise, it will bleed through to the next page again. That's really pretty. But there's no reason why you can't use felt tip pens or, or Sharpies in here as long as, like I said, as long as you put something behind it. I do like these single sided pages. Even though it creates a base paper, which a lot of people don't like, it don't bother me at all. Um, this one it just says Happy Easter. And I think sometimes you'll find that create space paper is different with, it, with different books. So for instance, this is thin, but not as thin as say, the, or doesn't feel as thin as paper in the Bennett Klein books for some reason, and I don't know why. I only have one of those though. So there's a girl holding a bunny. Some little Easter eggs. See, I love these ones, they're so easy to paint and, and colour and, and just... I can sit and do these sitting on my sofa with the baby in one arm and a pencil in the other or a pen in the other and colour. I've done colouring like that. And then we're back to... I think that was the beginning. Yeah, the beginning, because you get two pages of, of each thing. And also at the back, where it usually gives you the code for your PDF version, which you still do, and I'm covering up the code because it's my code, um, it also says shop for digital ed editions and it gives you the uh, addresses and then it also gives you their web address so you can go and look for the new colouring books coming out and leave an Amazon review. You can sign up for their newsletter as well and, and uh, on their website and then get uh, sent some free colouring pages as well which is great and something I will do because I do love the Jade Summer books and this one even though it's cutesy 
because it's a colour book for beginners, I'm thinking I can colour what I want and then leave it if I get bored with it for when Jennifer's old enough to colour and she can scribble on the rest of it. It's fantastic. So I will put an Amazon link below in the description box if you want to buy this one. I know it's going to be after Easter, so I do apologise as quick as I decided, I decided to get it the other day. Like I said, it arrived yesterday and I ordered it on, what day is it, Friday? It came Thursday, I ordered it on Wednesday. But still really cute, so definitely worth picking up. I am an Amazon affiliate, so if you do purchase it via that link, I will receive a small commission, which of course will be used to buy further colouring books and supplies for the channel. So I've hoped you've enjoyed this. If you have, leave me a comment down below, give me a thumbs up so other people will get to see this video, and don't forget to, to subscribe if you're not already a subscriber, and um, you know, just leave me a comment, hit the bell as well, so you can receive notifications every time I post a video, and I will see you soon with the next one. Bye.